Many who have died by suicide may have also had an undiagnosed case of autism. That in a report at Study Finds, where we invite you to like and subscribe to get the latest information. Troubling research by a team from Nottingham University finds a high rate of people who died by suicide may have had an undiagnosed case of autism. This is the first ever research project to investigate the relationship between suicide in the United Kingdom and autism. Researchers analyzed a total of 372 coroner's reports examining people who died by suicide. The team also conducted interviews with family members of the deceased. The first half of the analysis revealed that 10% of those who passed away by suicide showed at least some evidence of elevated autistic traits, suggesting undiagnosed autism. This would be 11 times higher than the UK's official autism rate. After completing this second portion of the study, which included family interviews, researchers found evidence of elevated autism traits among even more individuals dying by suicide, up to 41%. Previous studies conducted by these same scientists found that up to 66% of autistic adults have experienced suicidal thoughts, with 35% actually attempting suicide. Meanwhile, despite estimates showing only 1% of the UK population having a formal diagnosis of autism, 15% of all UK adults who attempt suicide are autistic. Study authors urge the importance of developing more efficient ways to diagnose all forms of autism as early as possible. They also recommend the development of tailored suicide prevention services for autistic individuals, Check out the link in the description below for a lot more detail on this and other studies at studyfinds.com.